my dear students in this class let us list out the characteristic features of mycoplasmas in 1966 international society of nomenclature of bacteria has separated mycoplasma from bacteria and placed it in class molecules the systematic position of mycoplasma is it belongs to the class molecules order mycoplasma tails and genus mycoplasma mycoplasmas are ubiquitous in nature that means they are omnipresent they are found everywhere in nature plants insects and other animals serve as reservoir hosts for this mycoplasmas mycoplasma resides in mucosa of upper respiratory tract and the urinogenital tracts of human being they are also found in oral cavity medically important species are mycoplasma pneumoniae mycoplasma hominis mycoplasma genitalio mycoplasma is an extremely minute organism known to have the power of growth and reproduction in fact mycoplasma is considered as the smallest living organism they are polymorphic they have no definite shape due to lack of cell wall plasma membrane is present which is triple layered they need sterol for their growth there is no effect of antibiotics which act on cell walls that means antibiotics like penicillin and vancomycin do not work on mycoplasmas because normally these antibiotics block the formation of cell wall because of the absence of cell wall in case of mycoplasmas these antibiotics have no target in mycoplasmas their size ranges between 100 to 500 nanometers therefore they cannot be filtered through bacterial filter they contain both rna and dna ribosomes are also found in their cytoplasm they remain dependent on animals and plants and cause diseases in them and sometimes such organisms develop on dead organic matter in the saprophytic form thus they may grow as parasites or saprophytes so let me give the gist of today's lesson mycoplasma is the smallest living organism they lack cell wall because of the absence of cell wall antibiotics like vancomycin and penicillin do not work on them and they live as either parasites or saprophytes thank you very much